video will record patterns in real time. Use the step sequencer and adjust volume and pan settings. Chordcat also has chorus and reverb for changing tone, which we'll demonstrate in this tutorial. To record parts in real time, press the record button to prepare the recording. Now press the play button to start the track. You can activate the metronome by holding down shift and menu. Hold down Shift and press the Record button to undo what you just recorded. The Step Sequencer enables you to input notes to a pattern at various increments. To input notes in the Step Sequencer, select the track and pattern you want to use. Press the Hold key for the sound you want, and then press the Step button to input the sound where you want it. To adjust the volume on the keyboard, hold down the touch key of the sound you want to adjust and use the XY pad to change the volume. To adjust the panning of a sound, select the track or sound you want to adjust the left-right output balance for. Then hold down step button 14 and use the XY pad to adjust the output balance. To apply reverb, select the track you'd like to add the effect to. Hold down step button 15 and use the XY pad to adjust the reverb parameters. To apply chorus, select the track you'd like to apply the effect to. Then hold down step button 16 and use the XY pad to adjust the chorus parameters. <laughs> 